360. Our guest today is the CEO of Broadband TV, Sharzad Rafati. She is telling us some great stories about really making it work in the tech world, which is just so incredibly competitive. I mean, do you ever, I mean, how do you stay ahead of that? You know what I mean? Like there's always somebody out there, some kid who's got the next great idea. Is that, do you feel that pressure? Um, it's good pressure. It's really good pressure. It's, uh, it makes you uh, want to um, always push the envelope and, you know, think outside the box. And, uh, and um, and it's all about also I think a lot of times you know great ideas come uh, from you uh, networking with like-minded people, exchanging ideas, collaborating with each other. Um, I was in Munich just last week and uh, met with a lot of great entrepreneurs, and uh, it's it's always so refreshing because to meet with people with a different background, different set of ideas, um, and it gets you thinking. So I, th I think it's, it's very positive. What do you look for when you hire somebody? I know that the first time you had money, you said, and you were able to hire employees, that was a big jump, right? That was a, a big hire. What do you look for? Um, I would say we look at a few different things. Number one is a right culture fit. And um, you know, we built this great culture at Broadband TV, and um, now we're more protective than ever before because every person that we add, we want to make sure they're very entrepreneurial, that, that they're not afraid to take a risk. Uh, that they're, you know, they want to think outside the box. We have four values at Broadband TV. It's uh, creativity, innovation, drive, and care. Um, so anyone that we really hire, we want to make sure they have those four values in them. Um, I think the second is attitude. It's having the right attitude. I think you could be extremely capable and, uh, and, and, and intelligent, but if you don't have the right attitude, it's just not going to work. And then third, I would get, go with capability, potential. And, uh, and, and, and uh, we're in a new industry. Nothing is defined. So you can't hire someone that has you know, 20 years of experience in what we do. Um, so it's a lot to do with uh, their potential and capability. We have a very young team, but extremely um, you know, great culture, very, very great attitude, very intelligent and capable. And, and last would be expertise, but I think I would actually go in that, in that order. When your company did start to expand and all of a sudden there were a lot more people that you had to rely on to make your vision happen, was that a difficult thing to let go of? Um, I think as, a, as, as, as an entrepreneur, you know, if you want to be a successful one, you need to grow and, um, and you need to learn to delegate. Um, and more importantly, you need to be able to uh, clearly communicate your vision. Uh, to everyone. I think um, this is probably the most important thing uh, in terms of having a clear vision and taking everyone on that journey and communicating that vision with everyone. Uh, and I think you need to, you know, uh, hire smarter people than you, you know, surround yourself with people that know what they're doing. They're specifically and uh, expert in what they, what they do and uh, delegate and, you know, trust, have trust in them. And <clears throat> especially with us, um, I, I tell everyone, we're all about quick failures. So don't be afraid to make mistakes. Just don't make the same mistakes twice. All right, so where do you see broadband TV in the next five or 10 years? Um, I want broadband, to be, broadband TV to become as strong and powerful as Viacom. That's what I want us to build and out of Vancouver. So, um, and, and, um, and I think that there's a lot of work that we need to do. I mean, we've done a great job in terms of building great tech and you know, um, a d distribution network, but there are many other things that we need to do in order to achieve that goal. Okay, so what's next for you then? Where do you go? Do you have a list? Do you know oh, where yes. you're going? Do you see the plan in your head? And yes, there's a vision, and that vision is communicated with the team. So um, it's, uh, it's both organic and also by acquisition, both.